Most Bible Prophecy TV preachers are like the rest of the world, totally focused on the negotiations between Netanyahu and Mahmoud Abbas, which were wisely suspended by Prime Minister Netanyahu just days ago. However, today's unanimous batch of blind Bible prophecy preachers are again misleading God's people worldwide by falsely believing that Israel's negotiation efforts with the Muslims is the prime gauge of Daniel 9.27's foretold seven-year agreement. But that's not in the Bible at all that Israel will shake hands with the Muslim world. There's not one Bible prophecy which shows that Israel and the Muslim world must make an agreement at all in today's end times. In fact, Daniel 9.27 pinpoints that the only two parties which are guaranteed to sign a seven-year agreement are Antichrist, the Pope, and end-time Israel. These are the two parties to stay totally focused on whose historic negotiations are in their final stage with both parties, the Pope and end-time Jews of Israel, readying right now to sign an agreement of sorts. And as I've said many times before, could other world leaders sign on to the coming foretold seven-year agreement, like the United States leaders, or the United Nations, or even Mahmoud Abbas himself? Yes, it's definitely possible. However, it's not required at all, according to Daniel 9.27, which only pinpoints two parties who are guaranteed to sign it, being Antichrist, the Pope of Rome, and the end-time Jews of Israel. In fact, during Pope Francis' visit to Israel this month on May 25th and 26th, according to Israel National News, Israel will give legal custody of Mount Zion and other holy sites to the Pope. Then right after this, in June of 2014, Israel's Knesset officials are scheduled to go to the Vatican to attempt to sign the fundamental agreement which is a contract made by the Vatican in 1993, which gives the Pope full legal freedom to operate within the boundaries of Israel at will, including on the Temple Mount itself. This is the hugest and next end time prophecy to occur, already shaped up right now tangibly and ready for fulfillment in our generation. All of this is shown exclusively at HeIsNear.com and in the books and in prophetic videos I've put forth with hundreds of headlines which stunningly match and confirm it all. Without question, the next major end-time event to occur is about to gain the spotlight. With Daniel 9.27's final seven-year tribulation nearing its start, with an eventual signing, conceivably this year, of a seven-year agreement by the Pope of Rome and the end-time Jews of Israel both of whom will have the world's attention at the end of this month and then next month in June.